So here we are today at Upwood Shoot, a team put together by Nathan Little, and what an amazing day. Spectacular scenery, amazing topography, some of the best birds I've seen so far this season, and we haven't seen the tallest birds yet. The fogs come in around us a little bit, but the birds that we're picking out, the fog is still magnificent. There really is something here for everybody, but this shoot is famed for its super high, tall towering pheasants. First drive was a little bit windy, took me a little bit to get onto the birds. Rather than shooting my AYA number one deluxe with half and three quarter I'd normally shoot, today I'm shooting Miracu MK60s with 32 inch barrels, so huge field artillery guns that are getting a little bit of uh, getting used to. But I'm starting to hit birds now, which is great. My load of Fred, we're making a great team. He's not only helping me pick out the birds that are coming through the clouds, but also a few hints and tips here and there about where I'm missing and where I should be shooting. Great thing about today is the company. I haven't shot with these guys before, they're all incredibly friendly and some very, very good shots, which is a pleasure for me to watch. Sometimes it can be a bit demoralizing watching people bring down towering birds while my feeble attempts go shooting off into the atmosphere, but it really is encouraging to be with a team of selective but highly skilled guns and they're also great fun. So if this is the beginning of the day, I can't wait to see what's coming next. Shooting into the fog can be pretty tricky, not only because the birds are difficult to spot, but also you've got to be very careful about your backdrop. The mountain in front of us is pretty steep and there's beaters crossing, there's dogs working all the time. So not only have you got to pick the birds that are the best out of the bunch, but you've also got to make sure that they're safe shots. But everything here that's coming through that you can just about see through the fog is a good sporting bird, a 40 to 50 yard plus bird. I'm pretty sure there's more coming higher, but we just can't see them through the fog. But it can be challenging, judging distance, judging range, judging lead, judging speed are all pretty tricky when your visibility is limited. So far we're doing okay. Myself and my loader, Fred, he's got a system in terms of passing the gun. I can keep concentrating on the sky, looking for the birds, trying to pick them out and that gives you as much time as you need to then swing onto the bird, right onto it, pull in front of it and hopefully give it enough lead. So it's been a challenging start but a very enjoyable one. And that one as well. Well shot sir. I'm Nathan Little. Today we're here with a team that I'm hosting, a team of my friends at the Upper Wood Estate in the border of Lancashire and Yorkshire. Tremendous shoot and I've been coming here for quite a few years now. The shoot owners and the keepers are very good friends of mine and they really do put on a tremendous day. I always bring a team of guns here. We shoot, we have a great time. The guns know what they're shooting, they know what they want to shoot. They want to come and shoot really good, challenging birds and this place offers it as well as a really good atmosphere, great people and just great camaraderie in and a bit of banter as well thrown in for the mix.
Good afternoon, Martin Stratton speaking. I've just had the most fantastic day on this shoot. I've shot probably the least birds for the most cartridges I've ever shot, but they've been so fabulously challenging that even to shoot a few of them has been really satisfying and great company as ever. These were easily the most magnificent birds I've ever seen on a shoot. I'm sure there's others similar, but it must be one of the top ones. Absolutely fabulous. What an incredible finish to an incredible day. Shooting here at Upperwood has been something very special. Some of the highest birds I've ever seen, some of the most challenging conditions, incredible wind, a great team of guys to shoot with. So yeah, it's, it's had just about everything. I have to say I've been humbled a little bit by these birds. They have been a little bit higher than I'm used to. And not just that, the angles and the twisting and the turning and the judging of speed as well as distance. It's been a real yeah, learning experience, I'd say, but it's been great. The hospitality here is second to none. The banter has been fantastic and it's a day that I'll remember for a long time. It's one I think I need to practice for before I come again, but really the only way you can learn how to shoot these really tall birds is just by turning up and shooting them. It's been a real privilege, thanks to Nathan and the team here at Upperwood for making it so special and hopefully I can come back and do it all again next season.